Hello everybody, my name is Shredtex and welcome back to the Necromancer. Today everybody, I feel like I want to try and do some sieges because I want to see how powerful our magic can be if we use them on a large scale against hundreds of enemies in one go because it'd be pretty awesome. Anyway, though, to do that though, we need to get ourselves some more influence first so we can actually get the power to get a gigantic necromancy horde to go and attack one of these cities or castles. So that means I'm going to randomly go around and kill some lords which is... One of my favourite pastimes. And luckily for us, we have Count Andres, who's going to be... Is that... I don't think it would be Andres, is it? It may be, maybe. Anyway, <laughs> he's going to die. I, I hate to tell him this, but um, he his cookie has crumbled. The fat lady is singing, it is, it is his time to die. Uh, what's this? Shader complication in progress? I don't know. But all I do know is that it's ready to fight. Okay. Let's do this, everybody. Are we ready, men? Now, of course, we are actually fighting a hundred <laughs> humans, which means we're actually outnumbered two to one right now. But it's okay, because I'm going to use some magic powers. So we're going to go over there. We're going to do a, a nice light wind of death. Wait, who's this? Oh, it's just some horse archers, <laughs> which haven't got their guns out, so they're not actually very dangerous. Ah, enemy spotted. Wait, his army is actually pretty small. Wait a minute. That's not a hundred guys. What's going on here? Take this. Oh. Did I not kill? Oh, I was going to say, did I not kill anybody? <laughs> yes, I did. I definitely killed somebody. Let's do another, like, a nice light spell, shall we? Beautiful. Yes, I think people are right about that spell, by the way. I think there's like an A. What is that? This It's out. How dare you, sir? How dare you do this to me? I can heal those. Fine. Okay, my friends. The horde must move forward. Let's go in. I love my little banners and stuff as well. Banner Lord needs banners, everybody. Don't let anybody else say it, tell you otherwise. You cannot have a game called Banner Lord without banners in the battles, okay, everybody? It's very important. Okay, we're going to move forward. We're not going to use the cavalry yet. We're going to try and get a little bit closer first. Now, the enemy does still have a lot of archers. We didn't kill many of them on the first round. So I'm going to go back in now. We're going to do another light wind to death. Target spotted. Moving in. Actually, looking at this guy's cavalry, they suck. <laughs> <laughs> is this a mercenary we're fighting? It might be, actually. Wait, guys, stop moving, stop moving. Okay, good. Perfect. Perfect. I think I just wiped out their archers. Beautiful. Infantry, move in to engage. I like how Van's leading the front line here with his little horse there. Which is now not actually a dead horse. It's actually just a normal horse he's using now, but whatever. <gasps> Griffin Knights. They're here. Let me whack you, sir. If you're wondering how I'm doing this much damage against Griffin Knights with their armor, it's because I got magic damage, I think. I don't think it bypasses it or something. Ooh. Okay, everybody, go, go, go! Destroy them all! Wait, I'm lost. Where are the enemy? Oh, there <laughs> Do we already swarm the infantry division? That's what we did. Look at these skeleton swarm go. They're beautiful. Oh, is this the Lord? Oh, sorry, I thought that was a Lord. It's just some random dude. Got a nice hat, though. Looks like he's like a hockey player. <laughs> great job, everybody. We actually did great stuff there. I think that guy was had a lot of troops, so I think they were all low level. Because he hasn't got a lot of Griffin Knights or anything. He's just got like regular dudes. Oh, there's some infantry there. Okay, let's do this. I fight better on foot. Take my stick. Oh, oh, oh. There may be a few of them. Unfortunately for me being a necromancer, I can't really get good armor because I'm a necromancer. <laughs> I'd rather have increased in magical damage. Oh, yeah, I am Frankenstein. Feel my stick. No, he's, he's out of there. He's out of there. He's gone. Somebody killed us. Wait, I can kill the man. I got enough magic. What? Oh, yeah. What? Oh. <laughs> it's, uh, it's merely a flesh wound. Don't worry about it. Can somebody kill this man? Like anybody, please. Go and get him. He's going to miss, isn't he? he, he it's Ban Lord. Cavalry can't eat. Okay, he's just. <laughs> what? Dude, what are you doing? This is why we need more patches, everybody. Okay, I'll do it myself. Let me. Let me take control. Where is he? Oh, this guy's pretty tanky. Did I hit this guy with a spell a second ago? There you go. We got him in the end. Victory. I love my shield, by the way. It's pretty cool. I thought it was like a weird, like, emblem on the shield, but it's just my armor clipping through. Good job, everybody. Good job. Wow, we lost 47 units. <laughs> That's, uh... Hmm. Who's... Demi Griffin just killed Summon Skeleton. Well, <laughs> damn it. 
It is what it is, everybody. It is what it is. So, uh, this guy's mine. Also, I've learned between episodes... Well, I think I knew before, but I can't remember if I mentioned it or not. Apparently, your intelligence level doesn't just increase your capacity for magic. It also apparently increases... Uh, ooh, one car sister. The amount of skeletons you get per kill. So, we're actually becoming a more efficient necromancer in combat, which is pretty cool. Um, I will take all these people, for sure. We'll take those. And we'll take the skeletons, I think. Because... Um, yeah, these guys are limited on what they can level up to be. So I'd rather go for the guys that have maximum skills. Maximum potential, everybody. I don't think we'll go for these guards, though, because they are just skeletons. But these guys have, like, crazy buffs and stuff for their HP. So I think we'll go for those instead. Anyway, apart from that, let's go on, shall we? Oh, do we have enough? Oh, we need loads of people. Wait, we'll take all of them. Ah, oh, we're one short. We will take a single man. <laughs> He can be a walking blood bank for the vampires if they get hungry on the way over. It's fine. Okay, done. Uh, prisoners. Let's get rid of all those guys. I already have two lords in my party. Interesting. Okay, done. Now, hopefully, if we do that, uh, maybe we've got enough already. If we do that a few times, we should get enough influence to get a bigger army going so we can just go and destroy people. Uh, also, I was going to ask some questions. I've, I've seen this in comments recently. Uh, one that I thought was quite interesting is it does seem that... The skeletons do not require any food. Because I was looking, I was like, why is, why is this so slow? I was like, I got massive amounts of XP. It should be going really fast. Well, <laughs> that's because days of food, 339. And I've, only, I've got like literally 140 men. I'm pretty sure the skeletons either do not have any food or they have very little. But I think that's got a byproduct of unfortunately making the XP rate for stewardship deadly slow, everybody. It's like, <laughs> this is not going up at all. It's, it's pretty crazy. So we're trying to find like a necromar- uh, sorry, not necromarcy. A book about stewardship so we can maybe get some skill points there. But that basically means my dreams of having a lot of men may take a bit longer than I would like. But it's okay, whatever. Okay, uh, so apart from that, let's go for more polearm skills. More polearms for the polearm gods. Let's have a look around here. So there's some random uh, English. <laughs> I was going to say English. There's some random human settlements here which are kind of like by themselves now. I want to try and take one of them down. What was that? That sounds like a piece. No, we're fine. It's not a problem. I was, so what we're going to do, 561 dudes. So we're probably going to need at least a thousand guys. And I think we could do that. Because we got Valdric Wright running around. He's actually got himself loads of troops. I don't know how he's doing it. <laughs> he just seems to have like a massive party capacity. I, I'm nowhere near it. Anyway, so we're going to get these guys into a party. We could probably get more than that, actually. Is that like a thousand men right there? Yes. Yes, it is. We'll go for it. Join me, brothers. We'll destroy our foes. Okay, I'm going to do that. I'm going to quickly run back to this castle though to sell some of this loot and get rid of these prisoners. And then we're going to siege Anna City. It will be perfectly fine. Okay. Yes. I am definitely sure. We probably will get rid of the, um, the right guy later on. Because he hasn't really got any unique skills or anything. So we'll get rid of him at some point, but not yet. Uh, also, while I'm here, is there any cool... <gasps> Demi Griffin armor. Can I just put this on a random... No, I can't, damn it. <laughs> Give my donkey Demi Griffin armor, please. Is there anything I can get that's pretty cool, though? I've already got... Ah, uh, problem is, if I want to be a necromancer, I can't get rid of these items because they give you, like, these magic buffs. I still need some stuff on my shoulders and my feet, though. Eh, I guess for now we'll just have to leave it, I guess, but it'll be fine. Is there any cool weapons here? No. No, there's not. I wish there was a way they can get rid of all the base game items, because it's, it's kind of weird <laughs> playing a game like this when you're like, oh, yeah, uh, we got all this, but also we got all these Khan equipment, because the Kuzates, I guess, used to be the vampires, or they changed them over. Anyway, we're going to go towards the city. With a big army. I Do we need more? We can get like one more dude. Let's get this. Let's get Marcus von Karstein. He can help us out. I want to use my magic in a siege. It's going to be epic. We're going to do it right away. Oh, don't worry about the random Windows error message. It happens all the time. <laughs> there was a reason for it. I did it like three seasons ago, but I can't remember why. I think it was like a really annoying noise. I hate it so much. I just removed it from the game itself. <laughs> I was like, I can't deal with this noise anymore. I'm modding it out. Okay. I don't think we need much more than a ram, to be honest. Ooh, there's a, there's a dude. What we'll do, we'll wait until morning. We're, I guess we'll start building a trebuchet and we're going to attack. Stay away, Baron. Stay away. Okay. We're going in. 
So what I'm hoping is going to happen here is... One, it won't crash. <laughs> and two, I'm also hoping that um, I can do some crazy magic attacks. That's what I really want to do. I want to do some devastating attacks. So I'm pretty sure we discovered in a previous episode that if you do like a big attack, it will phase through like the walls and stuff. So I'm pretty sure I could, don't even have to wait for the gates to be down. I could just shoot through the gate and kill everybody. Okay. Ready, men. We're going in. Now we've got to bear in mind, everybody, that we have literally no archers. Oh no, we got, whoa, oh, they're probably the basic ones, the humans we have running around. Cool. Whatever, it's fine, we'll leave them be. Okay, so let's go do some experiments, shall we? We must experiment. So I want to, first off, I want to check, so I want to be a scientist there, everybody. I want to be a scientist. So we got, not grave course, so we're a cheaper one. Raise the dead in a circle, right? If I cast it here, will they spawn the other side of the door and open it for me? Guys, guys, you can open the gate. I know you're there. I can see you. Open the gate, man. <laughs> open the gate, please. Well, I guess in theory it could work, but the bandled AI is really bad in sieges. So, um, yeah, uh, <laughs> awkward. wonder what there'd be. Um, wait, let's try and do some stuff quickly. Do that. Maybe that. No. I'm sorry, everybody. I tried my best. Okay, it didn't work out that well. Uh, so what we're doing instead then. We're going to get everybody just to go up here. Because I don't want to waste men in the end of the day. Let's get everybody safe and sound. We're not going to be fighting the enemy with their archers. We're just going to lose. So, oh, no, no. Don't look at me. Stay away, sir. Stay away. I wish my guy would open the door. <laughs> Damn it. This way, men. This way. Look at all these guys just being wrecked by all these guns. Can we have, like, a tighter formation? Maybe we should just hide them off the map or something. Wait, is there somewhere better we can go? Uh, it's a bit risky, a bit risky. I want to go I want to go somewhere where they can't actually be shot. Is that even as... Maybe around here? Yeah, this is good, this is good. Go, everyone, go over here. We must save lives. Wait, why am I over here? Why am I using magic? Bad game. Please don't die, Frank. <laughs> Please don't die. Okay, we got to wait for the old, uh... uh how many guys have we lost? 55? <clears throat> <laughs> Turns out when you can't really fire back at the enemy, it's pretty dangerous. Horse, can you get out of there, buddy? This is for his own good, okay? Horse, escape! Run away, buddy! Get out of there! No, no, that's a ram! Oh, no, <laughs> he set us back. What are you guys doing here? Oh, no. It's okay. It, it, it was really a flesh wound. It's not a problem. Yeah, let the vampire push the ram, but it'll be fine. Ooh, that was bounced off. Now, I would normally just fast forward, by the way, but because the uh, RTS one doesn't work at the moment with that, so we can't. We have to wait for the game just to move itself. Go, guys! It'll be cool, but by the way, just an idea here. What if they changed the ram to be some kind of, like, monster, and it punches down the gates? Can you imagine that? Like a, like a giant like death ogre just like punches down gates. Oh, that would be amazing. I don't know how that would work though. But still, it would be awesome. Okay. Phase two of me being a scientist, everybody. Can I shoot through a gate with my magic? We're about to find out. This gate's too powerful and too far away, but I want to see. Give it a second. Give it a second. I have a plan, everybody. I have a plan. We're going to pause the game. Excellent. <laughs> you fools. You think you're safe behind your wooden gates? Okay, I'm going to pause and go on the other side. And we're going to watch it and see if it comes through. It looks like it works, though. Oh, no. <laughs> Good job, Frank. Good job. Wow. Um, there you go, everybody. <laughs> that worked really well. That was perfect. Now, I would love it. I want to try something else as well. Is there any vampires nearby? No, I can't see anybody. Okay, guys, come over here. I didn't damage the gate at all. Literally no damage. Okay, my second thing I want to try is if I'm a vampire, can I jump up this high? <laughs> Just jump into their base? That'd be amazing. Out my way. Out. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, well, damn it, everybody. <laughs> I was going to do that skill again, but I guess not today. Not today. 
There's two things I can try. I think there's two things. Let's go in. Go, 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 everybody. Go, go, go. Oh, oh don't crash game. Don't crash game. Okay. Oh, it's too high up. Damn it. My dreams are ruined. Plan two, though. I think I need to be moving so I jump forward a little bit. So, like. Oh. Parkour! Oh, it's too high. Damn it. I just want to... Can we make it slightly higher so I can jump over the walls? That'd be amazing. Is that a thing, by the way? Like, oh, why do we buy build walls? Because they jump over them. <laughs> but then I guess if that was possible, the humans would have built taller walls so they could jump over them. Oh. Let me destroy you. No, sir, let me destroy you. Thank you. You guys are... You do know you're screwed, right? Look at all these skeletons coming through. Oh, magic spawn. Oh, no. Jump. You can't get me. I'm too high. Oh. Oh. <gasps> it does work. I saw this in the comments, by the way. How cool is this? Oh, it ran out. It ran out. You can become a bat, literally. I don't know what it does, though. But we must try it more. I don't know if it'll work because we're playing in uh, the art. So I'm not actually... This is not actually my character. So you get, like points based off hitting things and then you use it to become a vamp like a bat person temporarily so does that mean i can like climb over stuff wait wait let's try let's try this quickly oh it's like a fast travel ah okay i must investigate more the science within me give me your vampire points give me the power to oh headshot wait Oh, I want to try something as well. Oh, you can't kick though. Oh, okay, it doesn't work. They should make vampire kicks instant kills, by the way. If you can jump that high, if you kick a dude, they should just die. <laughs> they just fly across the map. It'd be amazing. Am I even doing anything? I don't know how that works. Uh, people know a little bit more about that. Let me, let me know, let me know. Oh yeah. Oh, oh no, oh no, I made a mistake. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Out my way, I'm first. Oh, no, I'm not. Oh, you could jump off even if you're already on a ladder. Wait, oh, before the map, wait, don't end the map. Don't end the map, I just want to try something. Oh, it's too far away, I want to jump across. Good job, everybody. We lost 257 people, yes. Could it have gone better, yes. But... Now we can now hire <laughs> another hundred and like whatever. It's totally fine. Um, oh, actually. Ah, oh, I barely even lost any troops at all. That kind of sucks. We can put these guys in the garrison, everybody. I get an instant massive garrison from this situation. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. Okay. Take all the prisoners as well. Oh, we get. Oh, that's amazing. Like you win a battle. And as a necromancer, you don't have to worry about it being taken over again. You have an instant garrison. That's awesome. State troopy. This is like a female uniform to me. <laughs> hmm. I look absolutely dapper, everybody. Let me just get let me just change myself a bit. Let's uh let me just have a nice little hat. There you go. I look like a respectable citizen if you ask me. Look at me. I'm so I'm so like noble. Anyway, let's not wear that, shall we? Done. Oh, are we are we done here, game? Oh no, it crashed! No. Okay, everybody, we have done it again. So I quickly just, uh, of course, it crashed. <laughs> so I ended it again off camera, but that that was pretty fun, apart from the uh, unfortunate end there. But we managed to destroy and devastate another location. I feel like the game's gonna help me hate me here, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I don't really want. I just want to show mercy. Because this is going to be my city. I'm pretty sure they're going to give it to me. Because I don't own any land anywhere. They must give it to me, surely. But anyway, apart from that, uh, let's go into trade. Give away the stuff we just made there. And also, we have a lot of money. We have a lot of money. Oh, there's another Magister here. Let me just mm, save in case. Nah, I'll be fine. What could possibly go wrong? I love these uh, splash screens, by the way. My friend. Do you sell? What, what am I doing here? I don't want to be here, so I want to be at the book guy. Do you sell any scrolls? What one to here do you reckon would be a stewardship scroll? Also, do you reckon the... I don't know. Can someone compare or just would they maybe know? 
Are these books different than the vampire books or are they exactly the same books? So that's what I'm kind of interested in as well. Okay, so what here do you reckon might be a stewardship book? Because I have no idea. <laughs> I don't really think I want to read through them all over to find out what one could be a stewardship book. I don't know. Well, this one, some of them are clearly about something. Art of War, presumably tactics, horse riding, dueling, one-handed skill, crossbow, guardian of the sea guard, maybe pole arms? Monster Hunter Manual. This one, who knows what this could be? Scouting, maybe? Naked and Afraid. Is that, that's a TV show, isn't it? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's a TV show my parents watch. <laughs> uh, raid, raiding Shades. Ra um, charm. To be a man of Ostlin. Maybe this one? If you read the description there, it looks like it might be... We're going to take this one as a chance. Trade. I reckon it's the one I just bought. I reckon this book here, I reckon this book we just got here is the Shieldship book. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take, well, I'm gonna take a guess. If it's not, well, damn it, everybody, <laughs> we've messed up. Because I don't think, I think it's gonna be pretty much any way I can actually get stewardship skills at this point, unless I change my army over to be like a human army so they eat food. We're kind of in trouble, everyone. Okay. Um. Wait, I can't. Ah. Wait, no. Can I not do it? Oh no. It won't let me do it. Oh, that sucks. Have I already done this book before? We may have already done this book before. Well. <laughs> Basically, everybody, damn it. That was pretty my bad. Uh, it is what it is, though. Okay, uh, let's carry on, shall we? That's some cool armor here, but I would love... <gasps> no, we can't even use guns. Also, we're a necromancer. That'd be so weird as getting out a, <laughs> a gun as a necromancer, but it would also be pretty cool. Okay, I think what we're going to do then... Uh, oh, by the way, in case people were wondering since last episode, uh, I did actually build a workshop and it's awful. <laughs> workshop income, 26. So I assume it's still base game workshops, which I think the maybe if you get like the optimal, optimal location, you can get like a few hundred pounds per day. But after what, they're pretty much trash in my opinion. But anyway, uh, let's also give it a few seconds. Game. Give me... No, no, I don't care about that. I care about the lead. I care about who is going to own this. <gasps> I forgot about the garrison, everybody. Oh, no. Now, knowing my luck, we probably just lost every single high level unit we could possibly even consider having in our army. So, yeah, um, that's just how it rolls with me, everybody. It's just how it rolls. Oh, no, I can't believe that happened. No, I forgot so bad. Well, I fixed it now, everybody. I fixed it now. It's okay. Um, but yes, we have probably just lost ourselves ridiculous amounts of stuff right there. Anyway, let's wait, let's wait for a little bit of time. Because there should be a vote at some point popping up so I can try and get control of the location. But the game's like, nah, you don't need... Oh, no, that's not it. Game, please give me what I want. Aha! Okay. It better be me. I'm going to go on a rampage, okay? Oh, who is this guy? Who are you? Why do you deserve this castle? You haven't done anything. You <laughs> Look at these guys' face paint. It's pretty weird. Uh, you, you're, you, you are beneath me. He already owns, like, half the map. And you are my enemy. I will kill you one day. This is a promise to you. You will be killed by my stupid game where you don't do anything. Ridiculous. Manfred as well. This is this is on you, okay? This is also on you. If I wasn't hampered by my extremely low amount of uh, units I can have in one army, I would be killing all of you, okay? But right now, I can't really deal with that because the enemy just has way more stuff than me. <laughs> and, and my allies as well. I would love it if I had more stuff, but game says no. Okay, uh, what's this? Improve endurance, yes. <laughs> Why would I not go for this one? It is literally a no-brainer. Okay, um, I feel really annoyed about them putting a garrison in now because he's just got a free garrison and they're not going to take it back. Damn it. Can we quickly switch sides to become... <laughs> we quickly switch over to be the Empire, just immediately attack the guy and take it back and go from there. Um, but yes, we're, we're, maybe not. <laughs> I'm a vassal, that'd be too much hassle. Oh no! Peter is going to take back the city, and I'm not going to do anything to help them about it. So, there you go. I will destroy this, sir. 
Can we send out somebody to pet fetch? Who wants to fetch? Um, we'll send out, we'll send out Volric. Volric, can you fetch the enemy, please? Get him, boy, get him. Get him, yes, yes, yes. Good boy. Okay, we're in. What is up with this face paint, everybody? <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is not many bees like in the mod. Did the Empire run around with ridiculously pink face paint? Probably not. It looks not, it looks awful. Okay, everybody, we may have crashed the last time I tried this, but this time I feel like we'll be okay, everyone. It's done it again. It keeps moving around these random formations. I don't know why. Game, stop it. Please, just keep this as the horse archers and keep this as the archers. It's not that hard. Wait, there's no way we have 44 archers. Uh, sorry, horse archers. Yeah. Bad lord. Sorry, tail wells. Give me the old system back. It was better. Okay, let's play the game, shall we? Okay, as we have so many, so much inventory, we're just going to attack. <laughs> my men, go forward, my swarm. Destroy our foes. I'm going to do what I do best, which is use the power of my magic as well. Are they in a choke point? Wait, where are they going? I don't know. Do you know what? We actually have, like, as many cavalry as the enemy does have units. Look at this. Look at the. Oh, yes. Wait, what? That wasn't very effective at all. What happened there? Game says no. What about this? There you go. That's a little better. <laughs> I feel better now. We killed some dudes. Uh, Cavalry, you can attack as well, okay? Let's go and whack some dudes. Hi. I have no fear. I am Frank Einstein. Okay, I took some damage there. Let's call some back up to distract the enemy. Oh, 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 never mind. Never mind. Didn't work out. Did not work out. Actually, I ain't got enough ma magic to back up anyway. Wha Whoa! Emmanuel! Did you just set fire to half our army? I think he did, by the way. Um, <laughs> he did not get the memo. We're meant to be killing the enemy, not killing the allies. He got it wrong. He's like, oh, my bad. <laughs> I just kill everything. He's done it. Marks us. Guys, stop it. Please, stop it. What are you doing? <laughs> the biggest threat to our empire was ourselves. Apparently. Yeah, we literally just lost these guys there. That was a bit disaster there. Uh, let me just do uh, a nice little two list. Problem is, I love my magic, but it is a bit dangerous for everybody. So we should probably be a bit careful here. Let's call some backup, though. Um, where's that Griffin Mount gone? There he is. Swarm around him, my skeletons. Excuse me? Would you like a swarm as well? I really don't mind. I, there's swarms for everybody. Oh, my HP! I'm still alive. Oh, that's not going to hit anybody, is it? Oh, no, it is. it's gone off into the... That's going to hit somebody someday. <laughs> it's like, goodbye, I salute you, Spell. This is going to cause, like, today, we have a rogue rain front going around the country. There's just blood everywhere for miles and miles. Can you imagine if that's the case in this galaxy? Like, in this uh, fantasy world? Imagine if they, like, went forward in time, like, to our time period. They, like, TV and weather reports, and it's like... A necromancer misfired their spell, and there's just blood everywhere. Uh, anyway, moving on. <laughs> Apart from me being completely insane. We eventually have killed them all, looks like it. And the game hasn't crashed this time, so... What happens if you press the button to become a, a bat while you're on horseback? Nothing happens. Okay, good to know, good to know. I just wanted to try out. <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Okay, it's fine, it's fine. I'm still not sure how this works, by the way. I'm still a bit confused by it, but... Whee! Fast travel. I'm pretty sure it just is like a, a safe fast travel. Good job, everybody. Good job. I should get every single skeleton back from that battle, surely. Um, oh. 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 No, sorry, sorry. <laughs> okay, it's so many error messages at this point. Um, the Grand Theologist. Theologist. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> We're calling Volker in the Grin, it's fine. Uh, we'll take that guy with us. You're coming with me, buddy. You're coming. Oh, there's too many guys. I, we've got too many guys, everybody. The guys, it's just too much. Okay, we'll take that. Look at all these upgrades, everybody. Fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Just like their face paint. Done. Now, do we want to go for another siege? I feel like we want to try again. Uh, this, this time we will be given. Um, wait, are you not going to join me now this time, buddy? Buddy. Buddy, why do you not want to join me? I could have given you loads of troops, actually. I just completely didn't think about that. 
Um, I will give you some skeletons. We'll give him some skelly bobs. Join me, brother. You suck. I hate to say it. You suck, man. You suck. You, you, you were meant to be my friend and you don't even want to join me. Who's these guys? I was like, another variant again. Interesting. Stalker. Though their stats are a little bit stinky. So I think we won't recruit any of those guys. Uh, let's just take these. Oh, wait. Ooh. 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 Okay, you can go on your way, buddy. Over prisoner limit. Take my prisoners and sell them somewhere. If you're going back to camp, buddy, just go and sell them. It'll be fine. Okay, off you go. Okay, so we have 880 dudes left. We have no wounded because we're vampires. <laughs> and the enemy has loads of defenses. So, oh, we probably can't do this, actually. Yeah, we probably can't do this. What we can do, though, is we can go this way. Oh, I really want to try something, but it may not work, everybody. We're going to do a sneaky little um, stealth save, and we're going to try something. So last time I broke into a siege or just attacked one of these guys. Wait, they got rams yet? I can't see any rams. We'll give it a few seconds. So I want to see if we can just, like, break in and help defenders. You lose 130 troops. It's not going to happen. When they start actually properly sieging, and we fight back... Okay, I didn't run out. If I join the battle right now... We have a massive amount of reinforcements. But the problem is, we are... The skeletons are not very strong. Uh, compared to the humans. So I don't think that's a good idea. We'll leave it, we'll leave it. We'll see how far they get, or how weak they become. There's an allied army there, though. Unfortunately... Whoa! They completely murdered that place. <laughs> they did not care whatsoever about the strength of that garrison. They just... They lost, like, 50 men and killed 500 skeletons. Well... Sucks to be those guys, I guess. It sucks to be those guys. We need to team up, guys. Well, this is my city. You back off. You back off, sir. Yeah, that's it. You jog on. Stay away from my city. I did say... Oh, no. Oh, no. Because we won't work together, we're not going to be able to... Wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Ah, oh, damn it. The AI sucks so much, everybody. I'm not afraid of saying that, by the way. I do actually think the AI sucks. Um, okay, we're going to go this way. We have to get out of here. Are we in trouble? Because I feel like we're in trouble. Because this army seems to be... Okay, he's gone that way. What we need to hope is... We need to hope that they attack the guy sieging there. They attack Murgle. And then we join forces of Murgle. Is that Luther? Is Superman nearby somewhere? I think he is. I think I think there's a Superman nearby. Oh no! I think they're gonna die before we even get there. <gasps> Give it like one. Wait, we're safe. Give it one second, buddy. No, you <laughs> terrible AI. Terrible AI. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry, everybody. It is what it is. Uh, I hear they have actually tried to improve it in the new patch. I have to wait to see it though. We'll have to wait to see it. Uh, this is a disaster. We're going to try it anyway, though. What can possibly go wrong? I feel like this is going to end in tears, uh, but we can probably run away if we need to at the last minute if we have enough troops left. Uh, let's start the battle. Let us start. Yes, summon loads of AI and crash the game. <laughs> Perfect. One of the main reasons I don't use um, summing skills very often is because it... Wait, how many guys are they summoned? Where is it? Defender army, 128. Yep, we're in danger zone, everybody. Somebody kill the skeletons quickly. <laughs> we're going to have too many of them. Okay, enemy has been spotted. Everybody, stand around here. I'm going to go and do some advanced magicry. No, 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 no. Bad, okay. We're going in. We're going in, everybody. We're going in. Okay, I want to do like an angle like this. Ooh, juicy. <laughs> that wasn't that good, though, to be fair. I think I only got sick. That was a waste of a spell, everybody. That was not perfect. Uh, jump over this guy. I'm trying to get back at the top so I can see my kills again. There you go. We've already started the main attack. That was quick. Uh, I could probably do a blood spell, actually. Uh, let's just see. Out my way. Beautiful. Okay, we probably need to attack with our entire force and have them on the back run. So, oh, the AI is being defensive. AI, this is not the time to be defensive, friends. We need to fight as a unit, and we need to go in and murder our enemies. Six seconds. The enemy stopped moving. I'm going to die to a gunshot, aren't I? I can feel it in my bones. Nope. We're, we're getting it. We're, going, we're doing it. We've done it. 
beautiful. That was a lot of damage. That was a lot of damage. Okay, the AI is still being bad, everybody. The AI is still being awful. Okay, run away, run away. Run away! Run away. The AI needs to charge. We cannot win against the enemy with skirmishing if we have like 50 dudes. Are you mad, game? Screw it. We have to make up for our AI's incompetence. We have to go in, everybody. Okay, we're going to delegate command of those guys. Archers, stand apart, do your own thing. They can't actually do anything, by the way, because they are literally uh, like level one archers. They're awful. Uh, we're going to play as a dude that we can actually fight with, though. Let's go and play as um, Claude. I am Claude. We need to attack, guys. We need to attack. Go, go, go. Oh, it's going to be a disaster. I can feel it in my bones, but it doesn't matter because I'm a vampire. Put Oh, what the? Uh, game. Oh, <laughs> what happened there? I don't know. Soldiers, charge. No, no, over here where the enemy is. Guys, why are you walking? Run. You're in a combat situation, guys. Run. Use your legs to reach the enemy in a fast manner. This is not time to run. This is time to charge. Okay, we made it. We made it. Charge, charge, charge. They're running away as well, which is perfect. So it means we get a bigger advantage here. So we're going to go in and kill them as they run away. Hopefully swarm them. These are some tanky boys. <laughs> they all take like 200 damage to kill. As long as we keep this going. Oh, that was a big hit for me. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. As long as I can be a vampire, fine. What I would love, by the way, as well, is like some kind of like health regen for the bat. Is that a thing in... Like, can they regenerate health HP in like mid-battle from like vampiring? I don't know. Just let me suck the blood, basically. I want to suck the blood. <laughs> How can I be a vampire and not have the ability to suck the blood? I mean... No, I do sometimes block if I feel like I have to. But not all the time. <laughs> okay, despite my ally doing absolutely nothing. Wait, we've convinced the ally to join forces with us. Keep pushing in, men. It's currently equal battle, which is amazing because we should not be equal at all because we are... Oh, that's a big boy. Nope. Oh, oh, no. oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I ducked underneath it. <laughs> I'm a ducker. You mother ducker. I'm the duckiest clawed in all the world. I was trying to escape, but it didn't really work out there. Um, it's, I'm not really sure what the point of that mode is. It. Somebody enlighten me in the comments, please. Enlighten me in the comments. What does being a bat even do for me, everybody? I don't seem to get any, like, lottery wins or anything. Um, I still have hay fever. It doesn't seem to help me whatsoever. Oh, that was nearly a death hit there. We do seem to be okay, but the enemy is absolutely ravaging our forces here. we got to bear in mind, this is an equal battle as well. So the enemy has a big advantage over us here. We may have to pull back and come back another day, I think, because uh, as it get, we use our good troops, they're going to have just better troops than us. But we're going to try for a bit longer anyway. Because we got to bear in mind, I'm not the um, focus of the enemy's attack here. My ally is. Oh, <laughs> reflex save. Oh, no, come on, great sword guy. Why am I playing as a human? What is it? He's got a mace, though, so he's pretty much as powerful as every skeleton in the, in the game anyway, so. You thought this is a regular human? No, it's a mace wielder. <laughs> Wait, the mace isn't killing him. What sorcery is this? What? This is, this is not... Okay, um... Why are we not... Do we have less troops than I thought we did? No, we've got guys coming in. We've got guys coming in. I want to play as somebody that's powerful. Wait, 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 wait. Take that! You may be a demigriffin, but I have a spear which stops everybody. The humans have the advantage now. The humans have the advantage. Everybody reform, reform. Listen to your command, skeleton. Reform, everybody. Reform. I really should be playing as like cavalry or something. Oh. Now it's a naked man. <laughs> Where is the cab? There! That's who I want to play as. What? Game says no, apparently. 
Game still. Game. Game. The humans have won this, by the way. Um, wait, is this a glaive? Oh! Ooh! I am a glaive man of the skeleton horde. Yeah, we've got to leave. We've got to leave everybody. We have to leave or we die. Oh, no. Leave or die. We do not want to risk losing all my companions because it's going to be so annoying getting the back. I'm going to run away. Run away. Run away. <laughs> By the way, can we just attribute all this failure to this one man right here? Uh, if he joined us earlier, we would have had such a large army in comparison. We would have definitely have won. Because there's two seconds or so that I had to go back and attack him again. We probably lost like 200 or 300 skeletons. But the good news is, is we did a lot of damage there. We did a lot of damage to that man. Um, the bad news is that we lost a lot of units ourselves. But we only need like one big battle and we get all that back anyway, so. Despicable Empire. Oh, but the humans have wounded troops and we do not have wounded troops. Yeah, th never mind. That was that was a pretty bad loss for us. Uh, we're going to run away. We're, get we're getting out of it. We have to leave. We have to get out of here. Can you join me again, buddy? I feel like you can. That, this guy gets troops ridiculously quick. Is that because he's a, a right king? Whatever he's... What, what are you called? What are you, buddy? What are you? I'm, I'm curious. White King. Is it because... Does the White King have like a superpower where they get units really quickly? Is that a thing? I don't know. Anyway, uh, I've got more skill points and stuff. Let's get some... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Take some of this. Take some of that. Take some of this as well. There's no point having medicine either because troops don't get wounded or heal. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they should change these skills for the Necromancers because they're both actually kind of... Uh, well, they're not useless. Is that how are you going to level them up? Oh, so much to me, apparently, that if you get 50 engineering, you can get an, uh, artillery weapons. Yes. <laughs> I would love artillery weapons. That would be great. I would definitely take that opportunity. Uh, let's get some more riding skills so we can get stuff on the way. Is anybody else leveled up? This man has leveled up. Wolverham has done it. Um... None of your skills really matter, though. Oh, sorry. There you go. Now you don't really... It doesn't matter what I do here. People are saying that I've missed loads of skill points on my companions, but if it's only two, then this guys are lying to me. Yes, in theory, there's a bunch of stuff that I can do. Oh, actually, this works. This is important. But overall, most of the skills aren't that useful. Um, in the game. <laughs> I hate to tell you people this, but that is kind of the case. Uh, let's get some skill. This is different, though. This is very different, because this is scouting skills. Uh, let's take some of that. I want movement speed if we can. Yes. Forest kin would be pretty handy in this situation. Done. How'd you get so much athletics, buddy? Because really, we, for these guys, we mostly just want uh, intelligent points so we can get more skills going, but um, it is what it is. Done and dusted. Okay. This is not going to last much longer. We need to attack something with this army before it gets disbanded. But I don't think we have the... But you do so. No, no, no. Yeah, so I expelled all my allies there to hopefully save myself. <laughs> and it kind of worked in a way. They, they backed off afterwards. Um, no. Oh, oh my god, you suck. <laughs> Buddy! Buddy! Oh, that was so close. He may have got hundreds of units in like five seconds. That doesn't mean they're any good though. <laughs> yes, I recruited millions of just skeletons or any weapons. Okay, this should be fine. We are... There is a lot of enemies here. But I have this, so it's fine. Uh, we're going to win the death mode. We're going to go in. This is a cool map though. I like, I like the swampiness of this location. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 no. Was that a good one? That was beautiful! That was perfect, everybody. Absolutely perfect. We didn't kill all of them, but they're going to be very weak. If I just do this, I'll probably kill loads. <laughs> Men, we can just go in now. Don't worry about the consequences. Uh, let me, do you guys want some friends to deal with? I feel like you do.
they may have spawned a bit too far away there. My bad. Uh, six seconds, and then you can do another attack. We're... Guys, leave me alone, okay? You've already lost, okay? I'm, t I'm too powerful. Oh, I hit a dude that ran in front. Damn it. Let me show you my real power. With the boot stick. What? How dare you, sir? How dare you? The boot stick cannot defeat a great sword, man. Where are the enemies at? There's one. Leather. Ow. Oh, there's a nice bird. It's having a good time. What, what happened there? <laughs> Rundan, what? Dude, you. What are you doing, man? Where, where are we trying to. Who, where is the enemy? I can't. Aha! 29 damage with a magic star? That's a bit mad. Uh, let's grab a horse, shall we? Let's, let's chase these guys on foot. I mean, um. <laughs> what? Damn it. Damn it, game. Nice. So we lost quite a few guys there, but overall, I think it was okay. I swear I captured this guy like three or four times. Uh, we'll take all these guys because we lost. Oh, we lost so many units. Oh, my God. Oh, that was probably from before, though. We probably lost more from the overall big battle than the other ones. So we'll take those guys. Perfect. Done. Yeah, shame I haven't got enough influence to get myself like a 2,000 strong army. Then we could probably take on that location again. I'm really curious to see how quick uh, Voldrick gets his troops back, by the way. Because he seems to just get troops from somewhere. I don't know where he's getting them from, but he's not fighting people. He's just getting troops. 53! What do you have before? That's gone up again. That's already gone up, hasn't it? How's he, how are you doing this, man? <laughs> he's a magic lad, he is. This Is this... Oh, someone let me know. Is this a skill of him being a white? Or is it a skill of him just... Guessing troops being like a necromancer ally or something. Because I'm really curious to see how that works. But anyway. Uh, oh, by the way, people might ask me just go, why don't you use this inside a city of your allies? Uh, if you try and steal good bodies for skeletons from necromancers and vampires, they hate you. <laughs> so yeah, it's not going to work out here. The only place I would use it is like some kind of city you don't care about. But um, that's not one of these places, that's for sure. Okay. What do I do with all this money now? I don't know, because we have a lot of money. Uh, I'm really tempted to get this instead of the um, Necromancer armor. I mean, at least just the breastplate, because oh, I look so cool. Because um, if I get this, I got the staff. We got like 10%, 20%. 20% increase already. We can get some boots that'd be 30% and the capes are 40%. So we can already have loads of stuff, but also this armor would be so powerful, it makes us a lot tanker in combat. I think we go for this. I'm gonna go for this armor, okay? Look, you guys can't talk me out of this, okay? Because I'm talking to myself right now. You have no say in it. <laughs> I'm in control here. Now, what I was gonna do as well, um, bye. I was also going to get myself some upgrades. So, we've been running around... Not myself, sorry. We have a magic staff. That's all we need at this point. We're, we're sorted. But my allies have been having issues in combat because their sword is okay. Well, actually, no, it's awful. <laughs> Rusty. <laughs> Six, seven damage is awful. We're going to get our guys some upgrades, okay? We're going to get our guys... Um, no, oh, the scythe's really low. I was going to pick... I was going to pick it. I'm not going to... I was going to pick the scythe. But having 70, 79 damage, not great. It's at 92... 68 swing speed. We're going to go for one of these. We're going to give him a vampire great axe. Uh, we give... Wolven's fine. We give Claude a vampire scythe. And I think that's it, actually. I think that's what we need to do there. So we get rid of that. Sorted sword. Is there any cool horses? I want to find some zombie horses. But I didn't see you just sell them anywhere. Like working ones. Ah! Whatever. And now we're poor again. <laughs> Just like everybody, our money is down the gutter. And our army is very small. It's, uh, it's weird how it happens, isn't it? You hate to see it, everybody. You absolutely hate to see it. Okay. Now, if we run around, let's see if we can jump on some low-level lords and stuff. Ooh, what's happening here? They're fighting each other. They must be, like, hostile factions. Where are all the lords, game? Nah, nah, nah. Whoa, I'm very fast. This is... 
let me destroy your caravan. And we get a speed bonus in Schwartz because we got the Forestkin thing. Beautiful. Let's go in. We have this. We, we got this. It's fine. I can't wait to there some like more. Um, they got some really cool armors at the moment, but I can't wait to see like the more add art they add into the game, with, like different muscles and stuff. I, I'm really looking forward to seeing how this game involves in the future. It's going to be absolutely amazing. This is only the what patch 0.2 for this mod, so there's so much to look forward to with this. It's going to be absolutely amazing. This is the kind of stuff I always wanted with Bandlord, though. Like, if I, to be honest, everybody, if I go back to, like, look at Warband, I got, like, two, three thousand hours playing Warband. I probably played 40 hours in base game, and I never touched it again. I was completely done at that point. Um, guys, can you leave me alone? What are you doing? Whoa, 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 were they going to kill me? I got a plan, I got a plan, I got a plan. I got a plan, I got a plan, I got a plan! No, I killed myself. I was going to try and move out the way of it, and they were going to, like, follow me into the gas cloud. It didn't work out. <laughs> It did not work out, everybody. Uh, yeah, I don't really have any interest in the base game. I've always loved the mods. The mods is where it's been at for me. And um, I probably, once it gets going, I'll probably never use base game again. <laughs> I'll probably just use... Um, just mods, everybody. Just mods. I know people are like, Oh, you have to have a vinegar experience. Doesn't do it for me, guys. Doesn't do it for me. I'm not going to lie. Okay. Also, I'm not really keen at that time period in general. I mean, I love the like the medieval period in general, but like that's like Dark Ages. It's, it's not not like cool like plate armor horses or anything like that. It's just oh, it does double kills. <gasps> this also, how are we not killing people with this axe? It's a giant axe. They're just like ah, it's okay. Don't worry about it. It's merely a flesh wound over and over again. This is really good axe. This is a really, really good axe. Look, I should have done this ages ago. Look at... Oh, we got hit by our own spell. Well, ally's spell. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, so hopefully... Uh, I don't know if Tail Wars ever will listen to anyone's feedback or anything. But I'll just say... Just do the uh, mod set... Uh, not meds. The mod tools, everybody. The mod tools. Quicker they get the mod tools up and running, the quicker we can play awesome mods. And I can't wait for it. In in the year 2045, maybe. <laughs> Good job, everybody. Good job. That went really smoothly. I thought we were in trouble because I died, but no, that went really well. I didn't even kill anybody. Frank, what are you doing, man? Uh, take those guys. Sorted. Bada bing, bada boom. Sorted, everybody. Perfect timing. Ep epic. The spot, I like how I got like armor upgrades and everything as well. I still died one hit. <laughs> just completely wiped out. Uh, I probably should finish this guy off. Because I just want to get everything he had. Thank you, buddy. Why is, why did that get me so many skeletons? <laughs> What's happening here? That one body was, he was, he was a merchant. He was so fat. He literally spawned in like 20 skeletons from just one body. It was, is really impressive. Okay. Uh, sorted. Let's have a look. Do you reckon we can sneak in one more Lord Kill? Reckon we can get a Salmon. Don't know. I thought we can do it though. Come on. Beautiful. I feel kind of bad for this guy. We're just doing this at this point. Trying to get ourselves some more renown and stuff as well. Oh, shame I didn't get this. If I got this, it'd be a lot easier. Because we can probably... <gasps> when I get to Clan Rank 3, that's something we haven't done in the mod yet. Clan Rank 3 unlocks the unique units from cities and stuff. So we can go and get ourselves like some regiments of renown, which I think that's what the system they called it. So it should be fun to look forward to. I feel like I'm more like, um, <laughs> I look so weird from the back. I feel like I'm more like Saruman now. I'm like, ah, is this Saruman? No, wait, maybe. Yeah, the thing is, the guy with the Lord of the Rings, the main guy with all his armor and stuff. You guys want to kill me? Because I'm going gonna to annoy you. I'm going to do this. No, they're doing the circle formation. Don't do it, guys. This is, it's suicide. What are you doing? That sucks. We got two kills. Let's, let's do a conditional. There you go. AOE of destruction. Beautiful. Okay, everybody, move into attack. I'm going to do like a really awful thing. Just spawn skittens right in the middle of them. Oh, I took some big hits there. To be fair, I might have saved myself having this armor there because I didn't die from being shot. Destroy them. Do you know what? The skeletons kicked ass. They did it. 
Good job, guys. Good job. No one escapes. Frank. Einstein. Oh, I got this. I got this. I got this. All right, dude, your stupid head got in the way. Wow, that was a wipe. We lost a few skeletons I summoned in there, but overall, that was great for us. I give up. Pull back your dogs. Should we, um... Problem is, the reason I haven't been doing it, by the way, I'm, I'm, I'm referring to executing lords. Now, the reason I haven't been doing it is because... In, it's normally not worth it. Everybody hates you. No one wants to join you. It's just, it's just a bunch of awfulness to most of the time. I'm going to... We, we may have to read all it if it doesn't work, but I'm just going to try it. We're, uh, we're going to kill a dude. Wait, is he a mercenary? Oh, there's no point killing mercenaries. Mercenaries respawn uh, within like an hour. <laughs> the only way to get rid of mercenaries is you have to do like all four of them at the same time to actually get rid of them. But we try, when we find an Empire Lord, we'll try executing them and see what happens. Especially if they have a griffin mount. So I might, I see people mention that you might be able to nick their equipment. And if I can get a griffin mount from doing that, then this would be the best game in the planet. So, okay. Right there, everybody. Hope that you have all enjoyed today's episode. Uh, as always, please like, subscribe, and comment below. And I'll see you next time. Bye.